What is happening, guys? I'm just here with, uh, well, Halo. I'm sick of Call of Duty. I fucking hate it. Be shit. All right, so we're going to play some SWAT here on Halo. And I'd like to talk about you guys. Why is this guy already running around? Did I join a late game again? I did. Why do I join late games in Halo? What is this Call of Duty? Pissing me off. That's one thing I want to say before we talk about anything about how Halo should have been better than Call of Duty. I played this game for like six hours, not even controlling. What the fuck was that? Okay, so we're playing here, and I think that Halo should be Call of Duty, only except the fact that Halo was trying to be Call of Duty, and that's why Halo fucked up real bad, because Halo had a good thing going for it. I don't know if you guys ever played Halo 2, but Halo 2, in my opinion, was one of the best online games of all time. If that would have been on 360, I, I think that would have outsold any Call of Duty game of the time, except for Call of Duty 4 had a really good online, but besides that, Halo... 2 had the best online out of any game ever, in my opinion. Had the best, the ranking system was perfect, the matchmaking was perfect, custom games, everything in that game was perfect, and now they're trying to be Call of Duty. Now, I am playing SWAT here because, you know, simply I don't want to get my ass kicked, maybe we'll play some Slayer in a minute, but as I was saying here, oh, you piece of shit, oh, damn it! Alright, so, as I was saying here, I think that Halo should be Call of Duty, because Call of Duty is a piece of shit, I'm tired of playing Call of Duty, I mean, if you guys want Call of Duty gameplay, I'll give it to you, but until this new map pack comes out, what the fuck, Treyarch, is there going to be another map pack, or you just fuck us over again, they'll, like, I'll probably sit there like, uh, I don't, I don't know what other map to make, can we make another jungle map, no! I don't, I don't, I'm tired of it. I'm seriously just sick of it. So we're going to play some Halo 4 and get our ass kicked for a while. Why? Stop pushing me. I guy's trying to push me. I'm not seeing anybody right now. I'm not really seeing anybody, and I suck. I have no kills. Can I get a kill? Shit. Oh. Distraction. Well, what the hell? I wanted to kill. Whatever. Fuck that shit. Ah, come back. Kill. What up? What up? What up? Oh, shit. All right. Well, I fucking suck. All right. So we're playing Halo here. And I'm playing this because I'm sick of Call of Duty. Uh, I'm sick of, you know, Call of Duty is just boring to me. Maybe if they maybe if they put a new map pack in Call of Duty, you know, ever, that would be great. I'm not seeing that coming out in June. It's definitely not coming out in June. You got for those people thinking it's coming out in June, no, it's probably gonna come out. My guess is mid-July. Mid-July is my guess, don't quote me on that, but as far as it goes, since they haven't announced a single thing yet, there hasn't even been a leak of anything, it's probably gonna come out mid-July, which is bullshit. Because after you guys have seen for Black Ops 1 for the map packs, uh, I think the second one came out June. It was like June 28th or something like that was when the when the third map pack came out for Black Ops 1. So they're a little late in the schedule here. I, I mean, I'm going to be really pissed if they don't come out with the last map pack till like October. That's going to be bullshit. Um, I feel like they should come out with at least five since we paid so much. But they're probably, you know, with them, the microtransactions. They might even come out with a fifth one. We have to pay extra for it for some reason, you know, because Treyarch got to love their money. Come on, baby. Give me the headshot. Oh. Sounds like Call of Duty. Look. Oh shit! I freaking meleeed him. Whatever. I got him. I don't know how we just killed each other. That never happens in Call of Duty. But the reason that I think this game didn't get it uh, was not as successful as Call of Duty is simply because they tried to be too much like Call of Duty. The ranking system is not what it used to be. The old Halo 3 style ranking system or Halo 2 style ranking system is much better, I believe. Um, the military ranks were kind of like, you know, it kind of prevented you from ranking up in Halo 3, which kind of annoyed me. Uh, Halo 2 definitely had the best. It was simple, but it was the best, definitely. Uh, and this game has this weird, it's kind of like a Call of Duty style ranking system to my knowledge. I only played about six hours of gameplay on this game, so I don't really know what it could possibly be. But the fact is that this game plays a lot better than Call of Duty, in my opinion. Uh, you know, for one, there's no freaking lag comp. I've never got a laggy. I've never been lagged. Uh, it's laggy in this game once. I've never gotten, you know, old Halo games. You get team standby and you get host booted and all this stuff. I haven't seen any of that in this game. Maybe because, you know, I don't have any of the map packs. That I guess that's, that's from downstairs. Okay. Uh, but I, I haven't got, like, you know, anything like that in this game. So it's pretty, it's pretty great. I mean, it's not laggy. I mean, that's the one thing that I'm loving about this game right now is there's no lag comp, so I'm not getting bullshit deaths. I'm getting, you know, standard, I should have died, you should have died, all that stuff. We kill each other even. It's pretty great. Besides that, though, I think they kind of fucked up on the ranking system. But as far as maps go, I've gotten Lockout before. I don't know if it was, it wasn't SWAT, actually. I got Lockout. From Halo 2, Lockout. You know, if freaking Infinity War would take lessons from... From it's not Bungie, it's 343. I guess this game is would we'll take lessons from them and actually make a good map. And they brought Crashback or Overgrown, you know, the maps we actually love instead of these piece of shit maps. But then again, you know, that's freaking Treyarch. Treyarch never really had any good maps. They tried to bring back Fire Range, and it was just a hunk of shit. So, either way, I mean, Lockout's still Lockout. That's one thing I love about this game is that it's still the same. I did not know you could sprint with X. When can you sprint in Halo? I thought Master Chief was always kind of had a brisk jog. I have no idea what's going on. Just figured out you can sprint. Holy shit, this is awesome. I'm sprinting right now in Halo. This is how much I play this game, guys. So, I was an advocate player of Halo 2 and Halo 3. I did not play Halo Reach or Halo Wars. I don't know if you consider Halo Wars an actual Halo title. That fucking sucks. 
Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Give me this dose. Give me it. Where the fuck did you go? Both the mat. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh, what the fuck was that? Alright, whatever. Alright, so reason I think this game is not better than Halo is simply because people have given up on Halo. I mean, I don't understand why people haven't given up on Call of Duty. I think because Call of Duty was actually playable in the uh, before, you know, if you played Call of Duty as through the years, you will still play Call of Duty. But I was, I, you know, I was originally a Halo player. Well, I was originally a Ghost Recon player, and then I turned to Halo when I got my, my Xbox because I played at my friend's house, and we played Ghost Recon. But then I switched to Halo once I got, you know, Xbox Live and a console. Started playing. I played Halo 2 online. That was my game for you know however many years you played Halo 2 online. It seemed like pff, forever. I went from Xbox One to 360, still playing Halo. At that point, Call of Duty 2 was out, and I believe that was pretty much it for the Call of Duty games. And Call of Duty 3 came out, and then the first game to actually pull me off of a Halo game was probably Call of Duty 4. And I played the shit out of Call of Duty 4, but that's you know that's the ancient history now. But I was a Halo player, and after Halo Wars and Halo Reach and what happened in Halo 3, I kind of had given up on the series. And what I don't understand is why no one wants to give up on the Call of Duty series. I mean, at this point I have, but I think no one wants to give up on the Call of Duty series, and I don't understand why. I like th what what makes us keep playing Call of Duty when it freaking sucks. Like this game is much better than Call of Duty, but no one plays it. So that's my Halo rant for the day. I, yeah, I suck at Halo, obviously. If you guys want to see me play more Halo and rant at you, I will. But uh, thanks for watching this video. If you guys like this video, go ahead and like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Tweet us at EpicWinTweeting. Uh, this has been MKiss.